Despite his dominant showing, Jerwin Ancajas also sustained lumps and bruises following his 12-round unanimous decision win over Jonas Sultan in their World Super Flyweight Championship showdown. A welt on his right eye and an aching forehead and cheek were just proof of the war he had to endure with Sultan at the Save Mart Center in Fresno, California on Saturday night. The reigning International Boxing Federation champion said a number of times he clashed heads with the challenger, resulting in several marks on his face a day after the title fight. Ito na head but poeko, he meekly said, while applying a pack of ice on his face, just before leaving the Courtyard Marriott Hotel with his team. Piero Hindi name and Sadia. Talagang Nanjayari Young Lalo at South Pakasieko. Ankajas raised his record to 31 with 20 KOs and had nothing but praises for his fellow Filipino. Malaka Su Muntak at Magandang Experience Rinyong Makalab and Angisang fighter Na Tulad Nia, he said, referring to Sultan's awkward style of fighting. Just before driving back here, the 26-year-old champion, trainer Jovan Jimenez, and Ancaja's small entourage were hosted for lunch by former Imus City Mayor Homer Sequilayan, who has been a longtime supporter of the Panabo City native, along with Philippine Olympic Committee Chairman Abraham Bamble Tolentino. Ancaja's famed survival training camp is located in Magalanes, Cavite, under the jurisdiction of Tolentino, who is congressman of the 7th District of Cavite. The House of Representative official was also the one who sponsored the construction of the camp's courtyard. Shortly after checking in at Sheraton Gateway Los Angeles Hotel, the champ relaxed in front of the huge television screen to watch Game 7 of the Eastern Conference Finals between the Cleveland Cavaliers and the Boston Celtics despite hardly having any sleep yet. Saglit Lang Ako Nakachalog Sabia, he said of the three-hour drive here from Fresno, accompanied by international matchmaker Sean Gibbons and son Brendan Gibbons. After savoring the Cavs' huge 87-79 win along with Jimenez, a LeBron James fan, to earn another trip to the NBA Finals, Ankaja shared dinner with his team consists of salad, chicken, rice, pizza and churros. A few hours after, it was already lights out inside the champion's room. Pagod na rinyan, sir. Halo's Walla Pank tulog after the fight, Jimenez told Manila based sports writers who tried to have some parting words from the champion before he was supposed to call it day.